Hey guys, so today I'm going to just quickly get into it. I'm not going to waste too much time. I'm going to be showing you guys how to use Gamma in order to actually create automated presentations using NA10. So we're going to connect Gamma API, which was just released to NA10. And then we're going to connect this to a live updating report that, you know, maybe is connected to your company or your business metrics or your financials or whatever kind of report you guys um, for your business are generating. And then we're going to use NA10 and Gamma to automatically create presentations for this. So these presentations, you could be creating them on a daily cadence or a weekly or even a monthly quarterly cadence. But the really nice thing is that instead of manually using hours to generate these reports, it's literally just going to be automatically generating these reports using AI and you guys can see them. So I'm going to demo this whole flow for you. So the first thing you guys have to do is subscribe subscribe to Gamma Pro. Only users of Gamma Pro have access to the Gamma API as I'm kind of trying to block out here that you guys can see. So the Gamma API keys, basically the way you get them is by going here to settings and members, then you go to API keys, and then you'd be able to see your API keys. But um, again, you have to be a pro user to use that. And I'm going to have a link to sign up for Pro uh, with my partner link in the description. After you sign up for Gamma Pro, the next thing you want to do is get your Google Sheets. So here is a Google Sheet I have. Um, this is something that any business might have. For example, if we have like a region of customers, uh, product categories, the name of the products, the sales rep, for example, the customer's company, unit sold, price, revenue, cost per unit, total cost, gross profit, per margin, customer segment, payment method, days to close lead source, right? So this is kind of like a typical sales report any um, typical company might be using. So we're going to have this in our flow here. So the first thing we're going to do is have a trigger. We'll just start with trigger manually for now. And then we're going to connect this to our Google Sheets. So we're going to go to our Google Sheets node here. Uh, we're going to look for get rows in a sheet. I'm going to call this get report data. And then we're going to choose gamma report YouTube. So we're going to do gamma report YouTube. I think I might have by url if it's kind of taking long so we're just going to get the data by url and then here we're going to choose c1 cool so let's just run this to make sure we get our data nice so once we have our data the next thing we want to do is put into anything as i just did before and then we could add like an open ai node if we just want to do like some sort of analysis on that raw data right so here i'm going to get my open ai node i'm going to message a model and then we're just going to keep this real simple, right? Firstly, let me choose GPT-5, which just came out recently, if you guys didn't know about that. And then here, the prompts are going to be something simple, right? Uh, generate a JSON that represents the most important, important information about our business, showing how we are growing metrics wise. Here is the data. So again, this is just something for the tutorial, but if you have a business, obviously you'd want to put like what you guys are actually trying to present in the presentation. I'm just gonna pull this here. Uh, we actually want everything. So I'm just gonna put JSON like that. And then all we need to do is output the content as JSON, come out to here and let's test this out now. So we're just going to wait for that model to finish. And then next thing we're going to do once that is done is we're going to send it to Gamma. So while that loads, I can start working on that. So basically, since right now in any 10 there's nothing like a Gamma node, we just have to use a HTTP request. So we're going to get a HTTP request now. It's going to be post. The good thing is we can import it just from Crow. So all we have to do is come here to the Gamma documentation, click that link, come over here. And we can just copy this and then we can come over here and literally just paste that curl in here. Okay, let me make sure I didn't copy something. Now we can just import it and that's all going to be here. So now we just need to get our API key, which I mentioned would be available. If we go back to gamma and the API key is available here. So on the API keys, so you're just going to have to create an API key and then it gives it to you. I already have my API key, so I'm just going to go get it now. Oh, I just have to click here. Okay, so now I have my API key. I'm gonna copy that, bring it over to here, paste, cool. And then I'm gonna uh, delete this API key when I'm done. So 
no worries about this guys so now we just need to wait uh, here you can just kind of change all of the information you need for your generation and you can even export it as a pdf or whatever you need but in this case i'm just gonna update this input text once our ai agent is done so we just need to wait for a little bit for our ai agent to finish yeah i know what's going on so it looks like this agent is taking forever I'm going to just try a different agent uh, if this doesn't finish anytime soon. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pull up this agent because uh, I don't really like slow agents. So we're going to pull this. We're going to add a chat model. Why don't we go with Anthropic Cloud Senate 4 for now? I'm just going to move that out of the way. And then uh, we need to give the same prompt. So I'm just going to define below. Just going to come here. Get the prompt. I'm going to stop this because it's just taking way too long. And then I'm going to put the prompt in here. Boom. Boom. No, okay, cool. Uh, I'm just going to leave it like this. And then let me actually, yeah, generate, generate a prompt. Generates a uh, description. No, generates a report, yeah. Okay, and then uh, we're just gonna do this. So let me run this again, skew this step. I'm just gonna wait for our agent to finish now. Okay, now this is done. So now I can send this, okay. Oh, you know what I should do? I should stringify it. Okay, so now that we stringify this, hopefully it works. Uh, nope, still not, let me see. Is it this? No, that's not. Oh, okay, that was it. Yes, it seems like the reason it wasn't working was because I had double quotes. So, you know, these are the things you guys just have to be aware of when you're working. So yeah, so after a few minutes of debugging, we finally have gotten our workflow. So you guys can see this workflow. It runs with a trigger, gets a report, aggregates that data, sends it to an agent for summarization, and then we send that summary to Gamma to generate our presentation. So now we're just going to head over to Gamma to see what it looks like and delete all of these. And then if we go to Gamma, we just have to wait a few seconds for it to get created. Um, I'll just wait a little bit because another thing is, you know, just something I realized is if you click into your presentation while it's getting generated, it's going to error out. So that's what happened these two. So just make sure you don't click into your presentation while it's getting generated. So this is going to wait for a little bit. Let me refresh. Yeah, it might take a little bit of a while, so we'll just wait. Okay, so now our gamma should be created, and here it is. So this is crazy. So crushing it, our Q4, let me present this. Our Q4 business growth story, okay. Wow, this is all created. You guys literally just saw this. It literally got all created from this Google Sheet automatically to this pipeline, and we have this crazy presentation. It's crazy. Wow. And just imagine you guys have this connected to your Google Sheet and it's literally just generating weekly, like these beautiful presentations weekly automatically. The the leverage that Gamma is going to unlock for, for individuals, for automators, it's unprecedented. Look at this, guys. Wow. I love this. Look at that. Right? All of this generated from AI, from with the images and everything. I can show you guys. You guys can also come here and view the source prompt, right? So again, this is what we pushed in, right? This is the source prompt and Gamma generates all of that. So you guys can see like what we can actually create. This is honestly very impressive. Um, the results are just crazy for me. I'm, I'm actually building this exact thing for a client right now. Um, so like, you guys can start making money from this workflow like immediately. I just wanted to demo that and show you guys how it is. The full guide to looking at, to building this out and also the pitfalls, because some things you need to be aware of that even I showed live here when debugging. I'm going to put all of that in my Gumroad. And if you guys want more leverage to learn more about this, definitely make sure you join my community. So um, yeah, hopefully this is helpful. Hopefully you guys are going to start building out these automated workflows. Excited to see how people are going to leverage this because um, AI is changing the world and the way you work. And I can just imagine if you're an employee or working for someone and you're able to create these presentations like so mo much more like presentable and quickly than the rest of your people, like it's just going to help you grow and leverage that. So yeah, hopefully this is helpful and I'll see you guys in the next video.